Take a look at this. This is a Michigan State professor's recent research project. The robotic fish went for a test swim at Crandall Park in Charlotte this afternoon. Researchers from MSU are using the robot as a more efficient way to study freshwater life. News 10's Claudia Sella spoke with the researchers who built the robotic fish as they tested it this afternoon. There's something fishy in the water at Crandall Park. It looks like a fish. It swims like a fish but it's actually a robot. Meet Grace, a robotic fish built by Michigan State University researchers to observe freshwater life by becoming a part of it. We can use a group of these robots to track uh, fish mi migration patterns and just their general hangout locations. Um, and also it comes equipped with a bunch of environmental sensors that can just monitor the quality of water, whether it's we want to test drinking quality for humans or just the habitat is safe for a fish to live in. In about $25,000 worth of equipment, this 69-pound robot is controlled from a station on land to study water life. Not just a robotic fish, but also it has gliding mechanism, just like glider. If you think about it, the uh, hand glider, right? So you jump off a high point and then it takes you forward uh, because of the gravity. So it'll essentially dive underwater and come back up to get a GPS fix and keep diving until it reaches its location. With support from the National Science Foundation and the Great Lakes Fishery Commission, GRACE was built to help scientists better understand and protect freshwater. Uh, we are all stewards of the greatest you know, freshwater watershed in the world. Um, uh, so we, we have a uh, overt um, uh, responsibility to protect it. If you thought fitting into school was tough, imagine trying to fit into a school of fish. But researchers say they have no doubt Grace will fit in just fine to whatever school she swims across. I think they'll be suspicious at first, but since it, it's designed to kind of look like them, they'll eventually get used to it. <laughs> and welcome him to the family. He can swim with the other fish in the school. <laughs> in Charlotte, Claudia Sella, News 10. And the robotic fish Grace is just one of the fish built by MSU researchers since that project started. Researchers say other projects include using robotic fish to study invasive freshwater species.